Hello, you are welcome to CTV News. I am Delphine Asu. The Catholic Archbishop of Abuja, Most Reverend Ignatius Kaigama, has condemned the killing of a Catholic priest in Benin. The condemnation was part of his homily during his visit to St. Augustine's parish, Sun City Estate, Abuja. Deaths. People are just dying like fowl, like animals. People are being killed. There is increasing evil and hatred. Again, you might have heard the news of the brutal murder of a Catholic priest, Reverend Father Charles, unknown Maile Igechi of the Archdiocese of Benin City. That news is terrible. What did he do? What offense did he commit? They attacked him brutally and killed him brutally. May his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. I don't know what the Catholic Church has done to criminals or those who just want to kill. I don't know. The priests are not enemies. The priests preach the message of love, the message of peace, unity, equity. The priests promote the dignity of life. The priests do not create confusion. They don't exercise their duty to bring confusion. They bring order, peace, discipline, and all that. So why are you killing them? What is the use? And remember, God made the life of the priest. And you are taking it away. You are violating God's order. And I don't know what judgment awaits those who kill priests. Those who kill other Nigerians. God is watching. He is not at idle or asleep. He is watching. So we pray that those who are doing evil stop. Are also attacked and killed. And the priest who is harmless on his way to duty or back from duty, he is arrest, uh, you know, arrested and killed by these people. I don't know for what reason. Archbishop Kegama then charged authorities to protect the church and priest who are always looking and working for the good of their society. The authorities must ensure that all Nigerians are safe. And more particularly that the Catholic priests who are being targeted these days are also protected. At the authorities, the Nigerian authorities must ensure that all Nigerians are well protected, including the Catholic priests. Despite the atrocities experienced, our Christian faith still teaches us that life is sacred. That life is what? Life is sacred. Christians must not discriminate and look down on others. You see, that is why we are Christians, because of the love of Jesus. He has taught us never to look down on people or discriminate against people. He has taught us not to promote our interests at the expense of others but to create a community of love where love reigns, peace reigns, unity reigns. That is what Christ taught us. We cannot be partaking of the Eucharist and believing in resentment towards other Nigerians. It would be a contradiction in terms that you come to receive Jesus who is the Prince of Peace, the author of love, and then you resent other Nigerians. Even if they are not from your tribe, or from your religion, you have no right to resent them. Reject people, to resent people because they are not Christians or because they are not like us. Our religion has not taught us that. And if you are a Christian, remember that always.